Charleston White pulls up on Lil Boosie and reacts to T.I. Son and Tootie Raw dissing. I got the whole video right here. I'm about to play it for you guys. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about Charleston White. Let me know what you guys think about T.I. and Boosie. Should Charleston be talking about the kids like that? Let me know and subscribe to the channel. Here we go. If all they can do is talk, they're going to do a lot of talking. I'm going to do a lot of doing. I ain't really got time, bro. I ain't really got time. 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 Why? I'm on top, I'm on fire. Say I done took over the internet. I'm talking about say, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got T.I. and him mad and talking. Uh, man, yeah, man. Son say he'll kick my ass. Say my mama raised big. Your mom and dad raised a yellow freak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That nigga T.I. son say, I whoop your old ass. Now, T.I., you raising these kind of little yellow motherfuckers. You got a yellow mother. Look how your son look, talking about he'll jump on a 50-something-year-old nigga. Yo, boy, hey, you, you, so T.I., them the kind of boys you got? Say, T.I., listen, if your boy jump on... Yo. First off, man, I just want to say thank you. Um, thank you to all the people who've been reaching out. Um, and showing love, support, respect for my family. I appreciate that. Uh, it don't go unnoticed. Um, thank you to Steven Jackson. Thank you to Minister Farrakhan. Uh, thank you to the entire nation of Islam. Thank you to my sister Hannah, my brother Clay, my brother KP, uh, my brother Bell. Um, thank you to uh, Director Dion Taylor. Thank you to Ronnie Jordan and the Ha Ha Mafia. Uh, Man, thank you to anybody like this. Like, bro, so I'm being attacked by the enemy. I'm being attacked by the enemy, and they using my weakness. You know what I'm saying? The weakness is social media. You know, somebody attack you on social media, it removes your ability to respond back to it because that only fans the flames and makes it, you know, but, 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 but it is still an attack, okay? And this is not the first time that I've been attacked in this manner and couldn't say anything, couldn't do anything. And I just watched everybody sit and didn't say nothing. Uh, thank you to Brother Kalanji. Thank you to Brother Kalanji. I, I reposted, uh, you know, his his comments. And so thank you, thank you. Thank you to the Water Boys. Um, <laughs> I appreciate, I appreciate y'all. So, so, so the hurt don't come from the enemy. You expect the enemy to attack. The hurt don't come from the enemy. The words of the enemy don't hurt me. The silence of the people that I've supported for 20 years, when they ain't gotten in the silence of the community, like the 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 way the community or to watch the community participate, laugh, like, share, and have nothing to say. Say I kick your old lad. Then he said he'll jump me. Well, what type of young niggas jump old niggas? Yeah, yeah, what type of... Yeah, yeah, and then when I get on the phone, y'all want to... Hold on, let me see if I can find the voice recording. I got the voice recording of me and T.I. on the phone. I'm going to send it to somebody. No I got the voice recording. Hold on. Oh, man. I got... Who want to... Who want I got the voice recording of me and T.I. personal phone conversation. Going on the show. Kanye West is releasing him and Diddy's secret text messages. Hold on, let me see. <laughs> Uh, what's up, buddy? Shit, we waiting on you, Jay. Ah, oh, that's cool. That's cool. Go ahead. That's cool. Go ahead. No matter. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Go ahead. Okay, yeah, now send it to the old then. I bet. I bet. Let me call my people. Let me call my people. It doesn't, yeah, yeah. I had to record this conversation just in case T.I. threatened me. I'm gonna put this motherfucking ass in jail. Hey, can you send me both recordings of the T.I. conversation? Yes. All right, thank you. 
to this number right here, please. Okay. All right, thanks. Uh, who want to buy it? Hot off the motherfucking press, it's coming. Yeah, who want to buy it? Yeah, God damn it. I got, I'm talking about voice recording like a mom. I'm talking about who want to buy it? Really? Who want to buy it? Sold to the highest bidder. Yeah, yeah, starting out at 10000 That's just the first video. Second video with me, him, and KP on it. The nigga he be rapping about. Me and KP in the trap with KP in the box. <laughs> KP. Me, with him and me and him on it. And I'm on there. And, and, and they trying to tell me how it's going to go. And I'm showing them how it's fits to go. Yeah, I'm, they telling me how it's about to go. How it's going to go. And I'm telling them it's going like what I'm, how I'm saying it's going. If you want to understand it? Okay, nigga. Here's the understanding. Ain't no understanding. I don't give a damn about getting no understanding about nothing. And I ain't giving a damn about helping no nigga to get now. We come. See, they say you can't talk about kids. They say kids is off limit. They say if you bring home an ugly, big girl, long head baby, and that baby got them ears that hang down here, you can't look at that baby and say, what's wrong with that motherfucker? Man, what kind of baby you done had, nigga? Boy, why that baby earl so low? You been drinking? Why that why you what well, that girl drinking with that baby? You guys got you can't you can't say this baby ugly. They say you can't say that. So yeah, man, nah, it's a whole bunch of niggas got some nicknames because they look like something when they were born. Yeah, ain't bullshit. There's a whole bunch of people in life. Man, this y'all interview gonna be down about two hours long. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh I got to call that Dixie house and tell them hold them motherfuckers for me. Yeah, on behalf of a family that has been there to support whatever was right, whatever cause was just and righteous, for over 20 years we've been there. And, and just to watch, nobody had nothing to say for for someone who ain't did nothing for nobody but shuck and jive. Um, that's, that's hurtful. It, 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 it was hurtful And I understand I'm a person who's strong And I understand that I'm a leader I understand that I'm a celebrity I understand Heavy is the head of he who wears the crown I do understand I understand that most times people don't even understand They don't even know when I need support They can't see it with their eyes I get that But now I'm telling you My hands being held behind my back I'm in the middle of the street About to get kicked in the face My family being threatened our children being threatened. What are the people who I've been standing up for for 20 years going to do on our behalf? I'm not causing for, I'm not calling for violence because that's not necessary. I don't think we can hurt anybody. I don't think we can hurt this person physically as much as life has already hurt them. And we'll continue to hurt them. Because the energy you put out is the energy you will receive. I just want to see the community at large stand up in opposition of this council. This is a council. This is not entertainment. This is not comedy. This is council, okay? And for somebody to say they're going to shoot my son in the throat like Trayvon Martin, to even let them play with the family, the names of the family of, of little bro Trayvon Martin, to even let that go down. That yellow mother right in his goddamn... Look, I wish, well, I wish an 18, 19 year old would jump on me. Boy, I Trayvon Martin, that little mother. I swear to God. My right hand to God. I swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. If T.I. son jump on me, I'm on George Zimmerman and Trayvon Martin, his little mother. I'm going to let him get on top of me. <laughs> yeah, I'm on Trayvon Martin, his mother. He got me f***ed up. You better get your son, T.I. Little yellow mother ain't never been hit across his goddamn head with a baton, with that Rodney King baton. Why hit that yellow mother who talking about jumping on me, hurting me? Boy, you better get your boy Tip, and you better tell him you work for Crime Stoppers. He talking about I got a badge. You had a badge before I had a badge, T.I. Remember, they had you going around doing a community service, talking to the kids about reporting crime because you got caught with a bunch of guns on federal paper. We don't know how you beat them charges, T.I., because one thing every nigga feds know, I don't give a damn about that shit, nigga. So tell your son, you what you inspired me to be a tipster. Yeah, yeah, I want to be like T.I.P. I used to wear my hat and everything like you. 
I want to be a tipster. So tell your son I got the badge idea from you. Get that little mother chick before he end up like Trayvon Martin with me. If you ever find yourself in a fight with a man with no arms, expect to get kicked. People do what they can. I ain't really got time. Hey, look, that's another thing, right? The devil used the hell out of especially with the internet, bro. The internet want the worst out of people. The internet reward the worst behavior, bro. You can come on here and spit number facts. You can spit number uplifting material to try and get people through their day. Your views gonna be low. As soon as you get on them doing some bullshit, man, talking some bullshit, nonsense, shit going through the roof. The devil will use you, man. And the reason you know the devil is using you, bro, is fear involved. All right? If you scared to face something, if you scared to show up somewhere, if you scared, like that, that's fear. God don't exist in fear. I walk around with no, no bodyguard, no security, most places. Not because I'm tough, not because I'm bad, not because I'm, you know, some kind of big ultimate gangster. It's because I've invested so much in myself, so much positive energy into these communities. That, man, people ain't got nothing but love and respect for me, bro. I ain't got to look over my shoulder because I done told on nobody, because I done robbed nobody, because I done shot nobody, because I done did nothing. People, whatever people feel about me, they feel that way because of love. They feel that way because of love. And love is from God. Fear is of the devil. I don't operate in fear. I don't need no whole bunch of police around me to go nowhere. I don't need no whole bunch of security around me to go nowhere, bro. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. They will form. They will not prosper. If I had done told on somebody, man, got them a whole bunch of time, they'd have been shot me a long time ago. They'd have sent somebody to shot, shoot me a long time ago, bro. Ain't worried about that. You can tell by how I move around. You can tell. And I'm covered. Covered by God. Covered by God, bro. This is God playing. I couldn't have thought of this shit. I ain't this smart. I couldn't have thought of this. I couldn't have, I could have got myself all the way here. I'm not that smart. I done f***ed up so many times. I would have blew it a long time ago, bro. I'm just here living out God at work. Doing God work. Living out God plan, bro. No one can interrupt the plan that God has made for you or anyone else. No one can. No one can. So... Y'all gonna feed into the bull, man. I'ma keep it on the. I'ma keep it on the level. I'ma keep. I'ma keep that shit on the level. I'm not just a rapper, bro. Rap is not. It's the beginning of what I did, but it's not all that I do. This shit cannot be fabricated for twenty some years, bro. I got time. Too many people to pay. I got too many people on payroll. Too many people depending on me to pay them. I ain't got time. I ain't got time. I ain't got time.